hello, this is not a spring chicken, as you can see. Yes, it says press. I was at the Huntington Art Gallery, renewed earlier today, which I absolutely love. The, new, the art gallery is reopening to the public uh, next week, May 28th, after a $20 million renovation. And it is. Now, this is the Huntington. If that name sounds familiar, places like Huntington Beach, Huntington Harbor. Yes, they tell me it's the same Huntington. And it is absolutely magnificent. It reminds me of, okay, you may have heard me say this before, the um, L'Hermitage in Leningrad, or is it Stalingrad now? Or otherwise known as the Hermitage. But Art Gallery was so beautiful, so elegantly done. And I was able to see, oh, shall I tease you about this? There were some absolutely gorgeous pieces up there. Um, what's the main one? The main one... Okay. Oh no, I can't show you all this. You're going to have to look at the website. Oh, you're going to have to look at the video we did about the Huntington itself. Which will be coming up here. Let me show you this. The Huntington Art Gallery. Isn't that gorgeous? very regal. In fact, sometimes it reminds you, maybe it makes you think of the White House. French art. They have an absolutely gorgeous library there, too. Now, one of the things I would recommend, because the Huntington is not only an art gallery, they have the library, they have, of course, the botanical gardens, a rose garden, a Japanese garden, a Chinese garden. You have to look at it and make sure that you are well prepared because, well, I would have loved to stay there longer, but I wasn't able to. We did the press preview. You can also have tea there, so it's a great place to bring relatives and make sure you bring really good walking shoes because while I was there, okay, I got very excited and lost my car and can you catch this one? You see that? A lady in the parking lot helped me because I got blisters. And I also have another one coming up on the other leg. <laughs> but it's absolutely, it's absolutely gorgeous. There's many, many places to see. Make sure you bring your camera because they do allow people to take cameras. It's a great place. Photography there for special events that you can contact the people. And just plan for a day. We have special events there all the time and it's absolutely gorgeous. But make sure you bring good walking shoes, good appetite, um, go have the tea ceremony and just enjoy yourself. So this is not a spring chip on the Huntington Art Gallery. Oh, oh one What's further that? question. Yes. People have asked this question. Are you Asian? Do I look Asian? Well, some people think you're a Caucasian. Do I look Caucasian? <laughs> oh, but I will tell you, we do have, let me show you this, their Chinese garden. This is the Garden of Flowing Fragrance. The garden is currently under construction. It opened up to the public earlier this year in February. And it is, when it finishes, will be the largest Chinese garden outside of China on over 12 acres. Yeah, a 12 acre Chinese garden, imagine that. And here's the amazing part is, there's such a huge property, it's absolutely gorgeous. And from what I've heard from other people, from um, a friend of mine, Boris, who um, studies museums and artwork all the time, he said that the Huntington is only 10% of the property that the gentleman owns. It's absolutely gorgeous. So go take a look. Huntington.org. Thank <laughs> you.